that if Satan cannot stop the prayer, he can become a member of the prayer meeting and begin to give prayer points. Satan can be the one that says, okay, this is the point. You people should pray today. This is the point. You're fasting tomorrow. Satan can ask, make sure you give three days fast. And if you don't have the courage, so you now realize that folks, after they have, long after they have become members of the church, rather than becoming advanced, becoming robust in their spiritual life, you will sense that they, they are, there is a sense of loss. There's a sense of depletion. Ten years ago when you knew that person, he was more, you know, well refined. Well, he was, he was more than what he is today. It's as if being in the church has made him more confused than being outside of the church and you see the greatest plague that satan can make your portion it's not sickness it's not bodily sickness the greatest plague that satan can give to you as a portion is called confusion so that the more you speak in tongues the more confused you become 